Thousands of commuters experienced their first day of the long anticipated summer of hell as Penn Station tracks get major upgrades. One America's Taylor Williams reports. Amtrak will undergo major upgrades at Penn Station, which connects thousands of commuters to the Big Apple. Day one of the partial shutdown of the nation's busiest train station went smoother than Governor Andrew Cuomo predicted. He initially projected a, quote, summer of hell with crowded platforms and long delays. Today went well. We're pleased with the results so far, and we're pleased that our commuters have really adapted to it flawlessly. At the Hoboken station, up to 16,000 additional commuters are expected to pass through every day. While tracks are closed through August, Amtrak, New Jersey Transit, and Long Island Railroad are being forced to run fewer trains to Penn Station. Inconvenienced riders are being rerouted to transfer stations. I left half an hour early, and so far my commute's been totally fine. Services have increased at ferries and buses to ease commuter pain, as well as additional train cars. Although the change in travel went well for most, some stations were more crowded than others. Yeah, it's just uh, I haven't seen this much congestion on the path in a long time, and um, trying to make it into work is not easy with these lines. The upgrades to the tracks and signals come after several trains derailed this year. About 600,000 commuters use New York City trains and subways on a daily basis. Taylor Williams, One American News.